Hello and welcome to another video of Commodore 64 games loading from cassette. Um, if you've watched any of my other videos, you may have heard me mention that I am actually in the US, but I have a Commodore 64C from the UK. This is one I bought back, uh, or I didn't buy it, actually my parents bought it for me back in uh, February 87, I think it was. And uh, this particular Commodore 64 has traveled with me throughout the years. So now in 2021, it's here in Florida with me and uh, the cassette deck that we're using actually did not come with this Commodore 64 it came with a VIC-20 that I got for Christmas back in 84 anyway that's the background here um, so these games a lot of them are UK games that will be on the mega playlist that I'm uh, compiling which will consist of about 400 Commodore 64 games and that equates to about a hundred hours of uh, tape loading screens and and uh, gameplay. Now I'll, I'll, I'll let you know in advance that the gameplay that is actually going to be longer than the tape loading. So I don't want you to feel that you're just watching it. You're spending three or four minutes watching a, a game load and only play it for about thirty seconds. That is not the case. Anyway, to, to, as far as today's game is concerned, uh, I will be loading up uh, one of these one ninety nine games from Firebird. This one is called Thrust. Now it's going to be interesting. I've not played this game uh, since the 1980s. Uh, but from what I remember, it's like very simple, uh, like vector type graphics. Um, you're out in space. To, uh, it's a regular shooting up. So that's my recollection of the game. Let's see if the uh, the tape even loads. All right, all right. I don't recall how long it takes to load. Um, as with all of my videos, I do everything in one take. So sometimes uh, you might see a video where the game didn't even load, and uh, I will try for several minutes and uh, then give up. But I'll still post the video. So uh, this particular game, I, back when I was a kid and I used to play these, I remember the, it seemed like these these games used to take forever to load. But I, since I've been doing it now in 2021, uh, I mean they're not instant, but it seems it's only about three or four minutes for these games to load, which really isn't a whole lot of time. But I guess when you're an impatient te uh, teenager, you know, uh, five minutes can take like uh, seem like five hours. All right, so thrust is loading up. Now, I think this game has some music as well, uh, which is noteworthy. We'll find out. So, Thrust. Let me see what I can tell you about Thrust. All right. So uh, while we're waiting for the game to load, uh, I just pulled up the Wikipedia article, and uh, it says that this game did come out in 1986. It was originally written for the BBC Micro, and then later ported to the uh, the 64, um, the Amstrad, and uh, the Spectrum, of course, and even the uh, Commodore 16, the Plus Four. I didn't know that. Um, quick glance on the right side of the page it does tell me that there is music in this game and it's composed by Rob Hubbard that genius of the of the SID chip All right, so we're about maybe three minutes in or so into the loading, or maybe coming up to four minutes. So we got to be pretty close, I think.
All right, we can let it play out a bit. Let's see if we can hear some of the music. And, uh... Let's start it up and let's see how it goes. All right, so it looks like it's joystick in port one, for those of you that are interested. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to get that. I saw the demo played over like a thousand times. I'm not sure what happened there. Uh, all right, let's see. All right, so I can go up and down. Oh, okay. Oh! Oh, man. All right. So the fuel thing's gone. So I, the thing is, I can't turn to the right. It can only turn to the left. Oh, that's weird. Oh, God. All right. Why can't I turn to the right? Oh, man. All right. Let's try this again. All right. Let's see if we can... Now, if I press the fire button, that's what gives me... Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I want to 
get get up. Oh my goodness. Alright. I mean this is port one, I wanna I don't know if it's, let me try and port two, maybe that's what's throwing me off. No, I can't even start the game with I can't even No, I can't even start the game with the joystick in two. Alright. Let me try this again. All right, see, so, I'm, so for me to do that, I'm pulling back on the joystick and pressing the fire button. So now, I'm not sure why he just disappeared. All right, so now I'd, I want to go to the right, but I cannot, so i got to keep tapping left and then... Oh, I don't know if I pick that thing up or not. Get up, go! Oh, my goodness. I don't know how I'm supposed to shoot these things, and I can't even control control my own ship. It's like it keeps falling to earth. So, like, once I'm flying, I can't shoot anything. I can only shoot straight up. Look. No, it, it didn't. I don't know how I got it to shoot last time. Stop! 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 See, I don't know. How I I don't know how I fired that. I think. All right. I can't. See, when I press the fire button, I want to shoot! Oh, goodness! Alright. So, what I'm going to do is that I guess while you uh, I guess what I'll do is I will um, look for the uh, for the box and actually read the instructions. <laughs> um where did I put it? This is thrust. Notice there's no music during the after you've played a game, you don't hear the music anymore. So, all right. So, uh, I just found the box for the game. So, um, while I'm reading the instructions, I'm figuring out how to, how to control my 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 aircraft. There, you can go ahead and leave some comments here about. How much I suck at playing this game. Alright, so let's see here. Uh, instructions. Let's see. Okay. So, so according to this, uh, you control your ship with the keyboard using the following keys. It doesn't even okay. So it doesn't even say that it supports joystick. 
So I think I was just getting lucky there. Alright, so what I'm going to do, it says here, so A is to rotate the ship anti-clockwise, S is to um, rotate the ship clockwise, return key is fire, shift is thrust. So let's see, shift and return. Okay, alright, so let's try, <laughs> alright, let's try, let's shift and return. Alright, this is going to be fun. Alright, start. Uh, uh, oh! I forgot how to thrust. Alright, but at least I can, I can spin both ways. Oh, look at that. Yep, return. Oh my goodness. Oh man, I am so like out of, like my hands are so like out of coordination. Oh no. <laughs> all right. No. All right. All right. All right. Don't fall. Go up. Ah, oh, we're still alive. All right. Now we're gonna get bad. Well, Oh man, look, someone shot me, man. <laughs> oh man. Oh, really? Alright, let's try it again. <laughs> Alright. Anna, go up, go up. Turn. Oh! <laughs> oh my god, I just disappeared into the, into the planet. Alright. Yes! How many times have I got to hit it? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Maybe I'm not even supposed to shoot it. Alright. Wait, one of these things was shooting at me, so it's probably... Oh, man. <laughs> alright, alright. So here we go. I want to try it. It's one of these things down here on the, on the bottom here. Yeah, it's probably that, yeah. Where am I supposed to shoot that and turn around? <laughs> turn around. All right. All right, here we go again. All right, let's, let's get some height. Turn around a bit. Oh my goodness, that they shoot at me. Let's go back. No, get back up, get back up. Get up, get up. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh, oh man! All right, <laughs> let's see again. Go on, get up, get up! Oh my goodness! All right, fire, 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 fire! Oh, I'm dead! No, <laughs> it's just like I can't get it. I oh, got another life! Oh my goodness! All right, all right. Wait, I got 750 points. How do I get 750 points? <laughs> all right. Oh, because I shot that thing down at the bottom there. All right, all right. Let's... Get up, get up. This is so... You <laughs> you think it's easy? Oh! My... But I like the game, though. <laughs> get up, get up. Let's get that little thing down there. Oh no, it's all going wrong again. <laughs> oh, my oh my god, no! <laughs> oh, I got another life! Oh my goodness! <laughs> get up, get up! Oh man! <laughs> so this is thrust uh, I paid uh, £1.99 pence for this back in uh, 86 or 87 um, I did notice in the Wikipedia article they were saying that the, the uh, Commodore 64 version was uh, actually released by um, um, who was it uh, I think uh, Superior Superior Software was the publisher for the Commodore 64 game. Um, 
because it was to be sold at full price, you know, which would have been like eight ninety five or nine ninety five for a cassette. Um, but like all other ports were um, were were published by Firebird and sold for one ninety nine. So I don't know how accurate that is, but I know that the copy of Thrust that I have for the Commodore sixty four is published by Firebird, and I paid one ninety nine just like all of the other ports. So. Um, if someone wants to verify that on the on the thrust Wikipedia page, <laughs> feel free to go ahead and uh, update that article. Anyway, um, <laughs> the, this was thrust. It's uh, <laughs> a pretty enjoyable game. I'm sure it'll be a lot a lot more entertaining once you know how to control the ship and actually shoot stuff. But yeah, this was the first time I've played it in like thirty something years, and I don't remember it being. I don't remember myself like having this much problem with it but anyway uh thanks for watching and uh i'll see you on the uh on the next video thanks again bye bye